dropship command to Assault 1. Blackbird is inbound with the package. Engines are powering up and weapon systems are online. ETA to takeoff is less than two minutes. Roger that, Command. The storm should give you enough cover to make a clean departure. I guess we'll see you in hell. Assault Lance, this is your captain speaking. Come to terms with the fact that we are not getting off this rock today. The intel we captured is worth way more than our sorry carcasses, so defend that dropship at all costs. There is no retreat, and there is no surrender. Check in, get me a sit rep. Locked and loaded. Standing by. Ready to go. Sensors are picking up several blips through the storm on the heels of our Castrol, about two clicks out. Let's meet them as far away from this LZ as possible. Form up. Move out on my lead. No mercy. Hey Wargamers, welcome back to the channel, Death From Above Wargaming. I'm Aaron, I'm Tom. and we are back with part four, Tom, of our campaign, uh, Bigger Fish to Fry. This takes place on a, uh, a border world in the Federated Suns called Celentaro. If you've not seen the first three parts, I recommend you go watch those. Now, uh, this is the fourth part, and uh, basically happens right on the heels of part three. Uh, when, when... <laughs> it's like the screen wipe. Right, it's like Rogue One mm -hmm. into New yeah, Hope. That's exactly... Oh, it's so funny, I was going with Star Wars as well. Nah, okay. uh, I mean, I like... It's where my brain is, Tom. Yeah. Uh, so, your... Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> <laughs> like, <laughs> we lose our audio. <laughs> it's, yeah, it's done. It's done, yeah. Well, copyright infringement. <laughs> uh, so, your Kestrel, uh, that has basically the, the uh, target of opportunity has just escaped Kingstown. Uh, and is fleeing uh, into the Dirge Valley where your dropship is parked. Now, it's beauty. all of your, I still didn't really know which, you know, from a narrative perspective, which ship had, you know, or like which, so all my forces basically split up chasing, and you know, one was chasing the Drillson, one was chasing the other Kestrel. So I have a small force that basically was chasing this one, and then we run into the looming shadow of your Fortress class dropship uh, off in the distance there. Uh, this is a little further to the north, so there is some snow, actually. Some, uh, some spring snow happening. There's a moderate snowfall. Wait. It is going to ex uh, obscure vision, 
long range visibility. right so long range is an additional plus one to hit extreme range is an additional plus two to hit mm. the drop ship is powered up it can shoot uh you also have some mech defenses uh, i have a lance as well yeah do you want to talk about the the drop ships yeah attacks? so so basically we're using uh, alpha strike uh i published a bunch of like small craft and drop ship cards a while back so we're using the card for the fortress class dropship Dropships have four arcs, right, left, and then top and bottom. So top and bottom are not in a factor here because you're not flying and you can't shoot through the ground. Uh, or can you? Uh, so gorilla. basically we're just using the right and the left arcs and we've yeah. sort of decided how to bisect this ship. So, uh, you know, the yeah. left side can shoot basically over here, right side can shoot over there. Yeah. So we'll see what happens. Now in terms of deployment, I have an 18 inch L shape area that I can deploy in from. Your Kestrel starts here, yeah. uh, which is basically the other of if it drew an 18 inch square, that's where that's at. Um, you can deploy anywhere in your base. So you have some you know, makeshift walls and things. You can deploy any of your mechs there. You do have blip counters because I don't know what your force is. However, you've already identified my mechs because they've been in pursuit, you know, shooting down, uh, you know, shooting at your Kestrel, I should say. So you've been radioing it for help. Now, are you ready, sir? As ready as I'll ever be. All right, well, we are gonna get into turn one, so guys, stay tuned. The action on Celentaro is coming right up. All right, here we are, turn one. Uh, things are happening. Uh, we are gonna start shooting, and uh, I'm gonna see if I can get lucky and take that Kestrel down. <laughs> I don't care who's in it, it's, that's it, it's going down. Now, if it does crash, Tom does need to retrieve the cargo. Uh, and bring it back to the dropship. So it adds some complexity for him. Unless doesn't... you like blow just it up. Just annihilate it. <laughs> just like all of them crit and just explodes midair. Okay. All right, so um, I was the attacker, which means you picked side yep. um, and moved first. I got the last move. So hey. you, you would technically shoot first. So you get to shoot hey. first. Uh, yo. Uh, Ciao. Okay, <laughs> I'll shoot first. Um, so you don't have to tell me what it is. Okay. Uh, but you just tell me how much damage it does. Uh, they each do ten at the Oh, okay. Damage. So I'm going to. I haven't touched the dice yet. Got to warm them up. Yeah. Got to warm them up, Tom. Which one? Yeah. Okay. 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 So I, I do three at extreme range. All um, right. What are you targeting? Yeah. So I'm going to target um, the archer. archer? Yeah. Okay. The archer's at a one. So I am. I. Uh, yeah. Three. Six, seven, and then eight, and then nine, ten, right? Two. Two for extreme. Yeah. So I'm at ten. Not gonna do one. And then the other guy, same. Just a shadow through the fog of snow. This oh. one, I got. You got one. I got one. Alright, so the archer takes a pip of damage. Pip. A lone pip. Crushing pip. I think we would call that a crushing pip. Crushing pip. Alright, so crushing check this out. Speaking of crushing pips. Uh, the Demolisher, everybody on my side is skill three as well. <laughs> so the Demolisher is going to fire twin Gauss rifles. Vengeance return. Right, this is, this is, right. All right, so let's see what happens here. <laughs> He's not even in the crowd. <laughs> three, seven. Two. Are we at extreme range? Yeah, yeah. 22. I don't think I can hit you. Do you need over a 12? I think so. Yeah. Oh, that was close though. It's close. Uh, all right. So Archer. Oh, with the, with the tank. Yeah, he's. What a punk. I mean, I still need twelves. Yeah. No. And then the. Nothing. Almost. Oh my! You had an eleven. I mean, this are is like short fly... do, do you, dude. Dude. What are there? Yeah, three. Yeah, with the with the snow. Yes. Seven? Oh, because it's a four. I'm yeah. I'm like that seems mm -hmm. crazy, but mm -hmm. it's because you are a one. I think I may need a thirteen. A four, but I was just seeing if I could roll a twelve sure. anyway. It would have been good. It would have been good. Uh, <laughs> nothing doing though. So shots have been fired. The archer takes you know a stray missile or something. We're not even sure. Uh, but moving forward, Tom, turn two is coming up now. Uh, again, if that thing gets to the drop ship, it has to land, get on it, then you have you know a few turns basically gotta power that thing up and <laughs> take yeah. off. What do we say? Three turns for departure? Uh or I think what? more than that. I think it was five turns for departure. We decided three was significically Too not easy. enough. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Are you gonna uh, um 
on camera. Oh, you want to do initiative on camera? I got my, I like my Avalon people like Hustler and Dice. Like oh my god. Wow. And you guys see again how the sausage is made. Uh, <laughs> we don't, we don't make it up. He loses initiative a lot. It happens all the time. <laughs> all right, uh, so we're ready to go to, to turn two. Uh, so I'll make the first move. Okay. Here we go. All right, guys, stay tuned. We'll be right back. We went to the we went to the, the record uh, and we did this yes it was so it's five turns for the dropship that basically so that once the VTOL lands within the, the, the area which it will do not this turn but next turn because it's just a little too far away then you then you have to basically just hold out for five turns yeah uh, also fun fact we did look up all the modifiers for the dropship which you know it's large it's a mobile it's a grounded dropship all of these things it's basically I need like fives to hit yeah, so it's very easy to hit four. But if I don't kill it fast enough, and these other evil mechs are approaching me, right? So that's that's sort of the the, the gist here. Yeah. The mission. Are you gonna try to take out some mechs first? I or? have to because I'm not in range of the dropship yet. Yeah. Oh, that's a good point. And also, you're gonna get toasted if you don't. So. Correct. <laughs> so we're gonna see what happens here. Now, I lost initiative means I need to fire first. Sure. Uh, I do love things with a with a TMM of one. So I'm gonna do just do a little bit of measuring here. Everything is at extreme range now. How are we still, they're so slow, we're still at extreme so range. So slow. Uh, <laughs> this rifleman did run, okay. uh, because I was, yeah, I had to do some some maneuvering there, uh, sprinted I should say. So I'm gonna get four attacks, and they're all going to go into this dude that's foolishly outside you the walls. have no idea. I have no is. idea what it is, it's probably the Shadowhawk. Um, we're gonna start with the- You, you wish it was the Shadowhawk. <laughs> I, I don't. Uh, I don't wish anything, Tom. Uh, all right, so demolisher, heavy tank firing two pips into the uh, into the blip over there. Uh, so we are at extreme range. Three, four. I need tens. Ooh. I got one. Bing. Uh, the Atlas I'm also all, similarly all the cards. needs tens. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Three oh, hits and a floating and a critical. Crit. Same same mech? Same mech, yeah. Okay. That is disgustingly gross. Alright, so here comes the critical hit roll, Tom. <laughs> this would be amazing. We were talking about if you actually took the Kestrel out. Uh, five. That, be... that is uh that's a non-critical hit. Okay. So can I re-roll that case my luck? That was a weird I don't even know if that counts as a roll to be honest. But that uh, happens. Unfortunately. Life. Yeah. Life. Sometimes the second rolls lose that magic. They you know? they lose the magic. I lost all the magic. Alright, so this this archer, the uh this is a 4M2. Mm, yeah. Love this puppy. And the shadow hawk is raining death right now. It's not a shadow hawk. So Maybe it's it probably is. the Atlas with like 42 <laughs> pips. Um here we go. Nothing. Nah, and then lastly, this uh, the Caesar. This is Hydra. I love that. I love the Caesar mech. What a so great cool. mech. I couldn't not use it again. Yeah. I could not use the two new ones that Randall sent to us yeah. again. Caesar's uh, so good. So good. I can't wait for the new Kickstarter stuff. Um, Caesar, this one does actually two pips. Same deal. Ooh. I got another one. Nice. Damn, you're really this is, uh, man, these guys are on it. That awesome is hurting. Now I know it's not the Shadowhawk or the Awesome. <laughs> Might be. <laughs> or is it? The okay. mind games. I can't handle it. Yeah. All right. So good round of shooting from the Avalon Hussars. Uh, what are you what, what are you doing? Gotta find a good dice to roll Gotta first. Find a good dice. Okay, there we go. Thank you, dice, for telling me what to do. Okay, first shot will be onto the archer again. I'm I'm pretty sure. So uh, three pips at extreme <clears throat> from one of my mechs. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And um, it'll be uh, tens again. I'm pretty sure. Okay. Yeah. Tens. Yeah. I'm not crazy. Oh, nothing. So close. Second mech. Same. Wow. I'm not doing good. The snow's blowing much harder on my side of the table. Yeah. 
It's like a squall then, over here. <laughs> and then just two. Nothing. Wow. I you are love it. I, I won that lucky. round. I won that this round. Not okay. Last game. Okay. So this is exciting. Uh, nothing revealed yet. I will. I will know wow, what those mechs are. I think you did five pips. Five, five pips. pips to my awesome. <laughs> All right. Well, turn three is coming up. Oh, you want to roll initiative? Yeah. I'm feeling. I'm feeling hot. I know. I'm feeling hot. Got hot hands. Seven. Seven. When I'm hot, I only tie you. <laughs> right. Four. Ooh, five. five. All sure. right. So okay. you win initiative again. Yeah. Uh, that's all right. I pretty much know where I'm moving. Doesn't matter. <laughs> yeah. It really doesn't matter. I'm going that away. <laughs> yeah. Get in range. Uh, so we're gonna we're gonna get in range. The kestrel's gonna be landing. I'm gonna have to put some fire into that uh, into that big ball of death. Oh, I for, I can shoot. Uh, it's not in range. Yeah, what does he have? 30 inch. 30. And he has, I believe, two pips. So once side. you're in range, I'm in range. Yeah, exactly. It's exactly. going to be painful. All right, guys. Uh, turn three. It's uh, it's Fast and Furious. Hola amigos, we are back. Uh, turn three. Is it turn three? It's turn three. C -C. I check my notes. C. Uh, turn trace. I say turn in Spanish. Just leave it in the comments. I, I like measuring stuff with the with the tape really long. Oh my god, now you're, hitting the, you're hitting the camera. Right. Chris is gonna yell at us. Okay. It's gonna happen. That's 17 inches. 17 inches. But so we are the danger zone has been oh, it's not quite not quite yet. Not quite entered yet. I haven't. I don't think I'm. Oh, you are. Yeah, that guy's in range. I think the rifleman and the Caesar are in range. Oh yeah. Oh, that's dangerous. I should hit think. just hit any part of the, that bulbous, delicious center. And if I, I think you're in the same arc. I tried to put them all in the same arc. So I moved first. I just I continued. Moving. I see what you did there. Yeah. They're still out of visual is. range. Right? There's only one guy that can do that. It's not your atlas. <laughs> they, he, he sprinted. They all moved three inches. Oh my God! <laughs> you don't think you don't think I would put my atlas <laughs> out by himself, like oh, running around the trees? Yeah. He's like jumping. <laughs> no, like, wow, there's no really, jumping. No jumping. Really fast atlas. <laughs> um, all right, so I lost initiative again, as you witnessed. Yeah, this is. was this a shell game? What was the guy I hit before? That's the guy on the far right. You don't know, right? I guess I don't. I should have watched you move. Should have paid closer attention. I did the three card. I did the yeah, three card. I, know what you, I see what you yeah, did. So, I feel like he'd still be targeted. <laughs> Um, but how could you? You don't know who he is. No, but I mean, you know, you have the blip, you see. Well, if you can, tell me. Or is that like I a legitimate we never, thing? We never really talked about it. All Here. I know is... High, high or low? Uh, highs. All right, I don't know. You don't know. All right, so these three, one, two, three, are all attacking the dropship. Whoa. All right. Okay, who are the other two? Uh, so they're at extreme range. I don't know yet. Okay. And I don't have to decide. Okay? Yeah. And we so, figured out it was a plus four. Or a five total to hit. Five total to hit. <clears throat> okay. That includes the weather and everything. It's just gigantic. Okay. That is uh, three points. Okay. From the archer. The rifleman also does three points. All right. And the okay. Caesar does two points. Wow. Good. Okay, so yeah. that's three, six, eight out of 26. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Okay, metagamer. Okay. <laughs> what else? What else you got? All right, so this Atlas is going to fire at the far left-hand target. Okay. Uh, and I believe, Tom, they're at 17 inches. Um, who are you firing the Atlas? Atlas 2. They are just okay. under 17 inches. So that's going to be long range. So yeah. 3, 6, 7, 8 with the snow. Um, and I do 4 pips at long range, which is exciting. So what did I say I needed? Yeah. 8. Yeah, it goes long. Yeah, yeah. 8. Ah! Oh, oh no! All right. Well, the demolisher's up. Uh, this guy does three at long. Same target. Same target. Oh my god. Well, I guess I rolled all my luck out, Tom. Now listen, you you did crazy damage to that drop ship. Okay. Um, crapola. It's your turn to retaliate. Yep. That drop ship is firing at that. Weapons hot. Weapons at which hot? one? The archer. Oh boy. So, <clears throat> I 
I, I do a total of 11, 14, 15, 16 damage, right? Per, per turn? Correct. Uh, well, you can do, what range are you at? You're at extreme range, right? Yeah. So you can do two pips at extreme. Per half. Oh, that's what the E means. We use X usually. Yeah, I know. I was I very confused. Sorry. So yeah, so it can do two pips. It can do significantly more once you get closer. Yeah. No, that's cool. Okay. okay. Whatever. Okay. No, I'm kidding. It's awesome. Um, <clears throat> so two. <gasps> two pips. Um, what's the piloting? Three. Yeah. Skill three. Still skill skill three. Okay. Yeah. So three. Um, and you can choose to split seven, fire freely eight, nine, without any penalty because you assume there's a whole crew. Awesome. All right. So if you want to, you know, let, you know, when you get into medium range or whatever, and you want to split it one on one, like you can certainly do that. Yeah. Okay. So three, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, that was close. <laughs> How do you need tens? You need nines because it's a stationary target, right? So I would oh. give a minus one for that, I think. Like if you're taking oh. the penalty for being a mobile, like it feels like Don't you should you get the penalty. The, the minus, the, the, the minus oh, one then bonus. I did get so one then you nine. got one pip. Okay. Um, and who does that go against? The archer? Uh, the archer, yeah. Okay, got it. So then um, next up will be an unnamed mech that does three damage at extreme. Er, ooh, they're not at extreme anymore. They're at long, Thomas. So not... Not unlike one of your mechs, he does okay. all of a sudden does four at mm. long range. What mech could it be? Does that <laughs> mech by chance have stealth armor that we forgot about? <laughs> we'll forget. It didn't. The snow, it doesn't, it doesn't the snow stack like with weather. It, it, it doesn't stack with the weather, there right? It's okay. a non stacking benefit. Oh okay. my god. So one of these mechs might be the Alice. Okay. okay. Um, so four pips coming in hot at the archer. Coming in hot. So long range. So three, six, seven, eight. Yes. Oh boy. But that is all four, four pips against <gasps> that bang, archer. Bang, 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 bang. That's good. Okay, and the archer again. Uh, needed uh, eight. Needed eight. So I get one. Okay. One more pip. Pip, pip. Okay. And then again, same. Same target? Yep. Oh, I just missed it. Got a max of seven, so you survive. Okay. And that's it. He sprinted, so I think that's everything. I fired three, fired All the right. drop ship. Having killed a mech yet. Wow. Haven't killed a mech yet. Archer is stripped. Oh, um, so you were right on the cusp there of doing some internal destruction. You're real close to stripping that dropship too. I'm nowhere near it. Uh, <laughs> I need, to, but I, I, I mean, three more turns of that kind of firepower, you'll be in trouble. Yeah, I need to do um, some. I you got to, you got to. Yeah, yeah. So we'll see. Okay. All right, moving forward, guys. Turn four is coming up. It's fast. It's deadly. Will I win initiative? Who knows? This is your time. Oh my god. Like, you literally can't script it. I've doubled it. Uh, alright. Well, regardless. Next turn. Here we come. It's turn four. You gonna do like an air guitar solo on here? No, I want to see who is now revealed. Mm, Everybody. Right. Oh, everyone's within medium range. <laughs> revealed. All right. So I'm gonna guess Shadowhawk, Awesome, Marauder, Atlas. No. Yes. Really? Yeah. Look at that, guys. This is why we wanted Adepticon, Tom. <laughs> you can't fool me. <laughs> Ah, uh, good times. All right, so look at those beautiful painted minis. By the way, uh, the dropship and these minis were painted uh, by my friend Brian over at Mechhead. Um, so Mechhead definitely check him out. Uh, he is a phenomenal painter. Um, so if you're too lazy to paint or if you want to throw some money at a hobbyist to uh, to do your dirty work or you want something painted at a level uh, that you quite can't, can't quite achieve yet, uh, definitely check out Brian over there. Absolutely love the dropship, love the mechs. Uh, very, very cool. So, 
That said, all of these mechs were painted by me, Tom. Okay. Yeah, you and they're going to be shooting. Okay, they look <laughs> so, good. They look really good. Hey, that's my cuts. You me. used uh, used uh, decals. I used it. I did. I, I used fighting piranographic decals. Um, I all right, really so, like them on the rifle. Then. Okay, go on. Thank you. Thank you. So, well, I want to do some shooting. I'm okay. going to do some shooting here. Uh, so we're at medium range. That is for a true. lot of things. I am going to continue though the the onslaught here, but I may actually change two, three, some, instead things, of three, two. some things up. Well, okay. I'm trying to figure out like I'm trying you, to min max, right? Because you in you in long range with any of them to the drop. Nothing, okay. no. But I, I think what's gonna happen is I think this archer is gonna go extreme range into the dropship. Yeah. Okay. That's the first thing that's gonna happen. So let's just do that real quick. Uh, so three five. peps. Mm -hmm. I need fives. Oh Just no, Tom. Wow. It can happen. Yeah, we were fives aren't a guarantee. Yeah. So the thing is this, <clears throat> I'm in water with the Caesar and I want to overheat with it. I'm sorry, with the rifleman and I want to overheat with it and do five points of damage to something like that, like that rifleman. Um, like I just want to like blow this thing apart this turn. Yeah. And I mean you're not going to, but you can try. All you want, my friend. Do it. Come on. All right. So you Atlas go. is going to shoot the drop ship. Three pips. Okay. Smart. Got it. All right. Three, so three more. four more pips in total uh, on that drop ship. So the drop ship is twelve to twenty six. Not quite dead yet, but I'm I'm trending. I'm trending positively. So I can deal with some of these mech forces. These guys are going to sight down that Marauder uh, as it just comes out of the, you know, the swirling snow, PPC barrels, smoking hot. Uh, we are going to unleash. They might be icing up, actually. Unle they might be icing up. There's a guy like the icing the, the, yeah. the PPC. <laughs> you crazy. They, they got the little you crazy. <laughs> you crazy. Uh, so he's going to overheat because I'm in the water. I'll dissipate that heat. Yeah. So he's going to do five pips, Tom. <laughs> this guy. All right. This is his debut on the channel. This is his big moment. Um, so three, four, five, six, I need sixes. Oh, we're at medium. We're at medium. And there's no snow penalty. In there's no snow penalty. Okay. Medium. It gets significantly easier as you've emerged yeah. from, the, from the, the fog. All right. So I need okay. sixes. Come on. Here we go. It's going to be nasty. Oh, everything. No. no. Oh, no. Okay. But I still managed to sneak three pips. All right, that's not what I wanted, folks. In case anybody was confused, that's yeah, not bad. Though. Caesar's going to do four pips at uh, at medium as well. Also needing. He's got no ov. Oh, he has no ov. Yeah, that's higher. Petition he, he just does four. Wow. Mm. Okay. Needed four. that sixth on the pilot die. Yeah. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four. Okay. Uh, all right. So that's a total of seven. Is that not eternal? Are you kidding me? <laughs> That's the dumbest marauder in the world. Yeah, I don't know what's wrong with him. How does it have so much armor? I don't know, he's beefed up in the gym. He's on these, he's Some on of these Hill Clan mechs are just nuts. <laughs> Although, I don't even know. It's a 2T. I don't know. Yeah. I remember we ran this one before. Yeah. I'll have to look up one. I think he's been juicing. We should get a, a P test. <laughs> Just make him pee in a cup. Yeah, after action report, we're like, he actually got disqualified from the match. Disqualified. In a, in a post game. He was, yeah, a drug test. All right, so listen, last thing, we're going to zip in a couple of Gauss slugs into this Marauder. Yeah, All right, good. now I want to just check. I don't think we're at medium. We're not. Are we at medium here? We're not. No. Okay, so he's at long range, so it's still going to be three pips from the Demolisher. Well, three, only for you. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight because of the snow, but seven because he stood still. Yeah. Okay, so I need sevens. Oh! Well, if no! you here, if you add them all up, did I get a seven? Can we do that as an alternate? Like an you alternate add roll? them and you get one. Yeah, yeah that sounds good. Way. Okay. What else you got? You you is that it? Drop ship, drop ship, marauder, marauder, marauder. Okay. I got nothing else. Marauders though. are they have luck. They Fantastic. Have great they, I mean, luck. it's also arguably one of the most iconic. Yeah. That's something you know. Yeah. It's like um. In battle. And they shall. No, no fear. Yes. <laughs> they they always get it. They always have it. <clears throat> okay, so the Shadowhawk, oh, uh, the drop's just going to fire first into the Archer. No. Still two pips. So three, seven, eight, nine, ten. 
Not gonna happen. Dude, the dropship, they're like, they're the worst gunners. Yeah. Sorry, sir. Their helmets are like backwards. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think I made that joke on this channel before about Spaceballs. That's what it always reminds me of. Okay. Um, the Atlas is going to fire into the Archer. They're oh at God. medium, I believe. Yeah, medium, mm. 10 inches. So medium, my Atlas, he did four. So we going to be three, four, five, six. Sixes. I get like all three. of them. Just three. That's... Forced to withdraw and a critical hit, Tom. Oh. Uh, you can't script it. That's your leader, too. What's his name? Dirge? Dirge. Dirty Dirge. Is that is that his... No, wait. What's his name? Jack something or other. I have Jack Reacher? Jack Reacher. Kind of looks like Jack Reacher. I cannot believe you filthy animal. I have, I have no mercy. There is no mercy. There is no mercy on the battlefield. I mean, friend. this sorry. is the problem with mounting the cockpit right on the like the <laughs> tip of the torso. <laughs> yeah, he's like, I got such great visibility, I can really I see get, around corners. Guys, I got. <laughs> 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 it's too good. Oh my god! Well, oh, he's dead. Sorry, sir. She <laughs> goes in the water. It's nice knowing you. Okay. Oh, well, next up would be the awesome. So the question is, <sighs> like, I, I want to be in. We're still in long range. Actually, we're in long range for both, so it doesn't really matter. And then we're in long, long. So unfortunately, I think that Caesar's about to get some brutal retaliation. Mm -hmm. um, so the awesome is going to fire at long range. At who? The Caesar. Don't forget the Caesar's in water. Yeah, so, so it's technically like a TMM of two. Just think of it that way. Okay. That's fine. Partial cover. Sure. So three, and we're at long, six, seven, eight. And then nine, nine, yeah, with the snow. Oh uh, my three. god, are wow. you kidding me, dude? So three what is happening? The, the Avalon Hussars. Three pips. I was afraid that I was gonna win too quick when we did this mission. Yeah. I was like, there's, I was like, there's a risk that I'm just gonna bring this dropship down so fast. Yeah. I remember, yeah, we were talking. That I was me because I could have still withdrew and like been Just dropping three pips. In I know, it. but oh no! Well, guess what? Now the now the uh, Marauder's getting his revenge. So Marauder's he's gonna gonna lose overheat her. at medium into the Caesar four pips. So we're three, four, five, six, seven. All right. Wow! I only guess one. One. I'm like holding my breath over here, Tom. Three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. So one pip. Um, and then the Shadow Hawk. The Shadow Hawk is going to do three at medium. Um, a Jack <laughs> yeah. Oh no. So three. Um, he's also going to overheat, actually. I'm going to go all in on this. This could be a quick game. Yeah. So four pips. Same, right? Three, four, five, yeah, six, seven. Yeah, sevens. Oh my god. I like it. Oh, you still more. got two. Yeah. So two more. Not the best. Oh but no. Okay. Okay. So. Can you mark him up? Can you reach that? Yeah, I can grab him. I got it. Okay. I got gotcha. you. I'll want to knock over half the terrain on the board. Well, I just did it anyway. Oh, there you go. <laughs> okay. Devastation this turn. It's been bad. water is stripped. Fortress is almost halfway, you know, stripped. Right, and then, so what we discussed, by the way, I don't know if we said this on camera or not, all I have to do is get into the structure. If I get into the structure, it's no longer space-worthy, right? And so that's my goal. However... <laughs> it's gonna start slowing down, yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm getting the... Oh, yeah. where's the... Where's the, We need, like, a giant dice for a turn counter or something cool. Oh, yeah, sure, I'll get one. I'll get one out of the armory. Yeah. All right, well, speaking of that... Um, Turn four is a wrap, Tom. You want to do initiative on camera? I hate doing initiative on camera. This is you want, you, we don't have to. It, no, it, you feel the like pressure. I feel pressure. Oh. Every, every time. Oh my god. <laughs> Yo, how many? I'd well, say, we actually have three ones on the board. But. Yeah, except for I got two of them. Yeah, that's true. 
Uh, all right. Well, over representation. Turn four is over, guys. Turn five. The turn of doom and destruction is on the way. You're not going to want to miss it. All right, it's turn five. Uh, this is classic uh, World War I tactics. Tom. Trench, hold the line warfare. This is gonna be Battle of the Somme. We're gonna be just expending men left and right for days. For days. For, for, a, for an inch. For an inch. For an inch. You know what I'm concerned about is what to do. Um, so I can attempt to, you know, like destroy the Marauder, right? Put some put put more fire on that atlas, like really damage a couple of your mechs. But then I put nothing on that dropship, and then then you've only got like three more turns, right? In this turn, you could do what nine or ten pips to the dropship if you focus. Yeah, on but it. I, I feel like if I don't kill anything, I'm dead. Yeah, you are. So I think what I'm gonna do, I lost initiative as everybody saw all over the internet. They watched me lose initiative. I'm going to unload on this Marauder as best that I can. So. This uh, the Marauder. This, ooh, okay. Yeah, this Rifleman uh, is going to start here. Actually, we're going to start with the Caesar. Yeah. So I got six total. Nice. Yeah, you got six total. So the Caesar has four. Jeez. Uh, at this range, and I need. I you, like st it. you stood still. I did. So I think I need fives. <laughs> Should these go away? Because I'm not in the water anymore. Uh, so uh, three, four, five. It's like hitting a dropship. Yeah. Sorry, Mom. Well, I think okay. you're going to hit... Got four. Hit four. Got so four. that's a crit. I, w I was hoping and for two crits. But keep going. All right, come on. On the nothing. 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 That's a nothing. That's the second time I've rolled a, a, a nothing You're burger. not going to get this one easy, easy I guess. So three, it's two pips left. Mm-hmm. I'm just going to point that out so I can still kill mm -hmm. you. I can still hurt. Yep. You're gonna try so, to take it out. Of the, I mean, it, what, it's, you have to if you you have, have to, to kill it. it. It does three pips a turn. It's, it's I have to kill it. So I'm gonna, I'm not gonna overheat with the rifleman. I'm just gonna go out. I don't like tell uh, you how to do it. Five. I need fives to hit. Wow, so, you're lucky you did that. Yeah, look at so that. So there it is. So okay, he's the marauder is destroyed. Now the demolisher uh, is in medium range with this atlas. Uh, three. Four, five, and he believes sixes because of your stupid stealth armor. Yep, stealth is not an effect. Which forever, we're just gonna pretend it didn't stack with the weather. Yeah, no, he, he was covered in snow. Totally covered in snow. Yeah. Um, well, actually, maybe it's heat signature. You know, it's like steam. Like, what's that like? What is that? Yeah. Did you just get out of sauna? Uh, all right, yeah. so I got four pips. You hit with all, man. This is this twin Gauss rifles to the chest. Now this Atlas, the AS8KE. You wanna know a fun, fun, fun fact about this one? This is like a recognition guide one. And I was like, oh man, I wonder what this is. And it's like the budget version of like some other Atlas. They like strip down all the all the extra parts. It's still a monster. I love it. Yeah. Uh, anyway, <clears throat> I need to do sixes and I got four pips. You go. Can't overheat, unfortunately. Oops. <clears throat> Here we go. That's guys. the budget part. That's the budget part. Here we go. Wow. Okay. Four more? Three more. Or three more. Okay. I can't read. So you get a crit. Okay. Stripped Atlas. He's got his shirt off. An eight, which okay. is a weapon hit maybe, Tom? An eight, a weapon hit, yeah. All right. I'll take it. I'll take it. That so hurts. we'll do that. And now I am going to prepare my mind and body for retaliation. <laughs> it's gonna come, it's gonna happen. Okay, so the shot, uh, oh, I'll start again with the dropship, I think is always okay. the best place. So he's gonna go for the Caesar. And I think you're still in the same arc, unfortunately. That didn't really work out. Oh no, you're not, you're not. I mean, we should, we at the laser level. Let's get that level. Oh, you got it, do it. Give me a line, here, let me. 
Okay, you can do it. No, I wanted to do it, but... Yeah, no, you're you're right. So the so Caesar's, Caesar's going to get the left facing for the first time in the match. For the first time in the Those history of the channel. Those guys have been staring at trees. <clears throat> so two pips. Um, minus one, so two. Um, six, seven, eight, nine. Not gonna get it with one. That was close. Um, and then on the other side, I'm gonna fire at the rifle. I'm gonna try to clear that side. Up. Okay. So um, seven will not. I need nine, eight, nines. I need nines at extreme. Three, three. four. You're at extreme still. Yeah. yeah okay. Twenty three inches. Oh yeah, yeah. All right. Right nines. Yeah. Yep. Three, and you're done, seven. right? You know, the other guys just you said they're just holding the line. Yep. Yeah, they're good. They're all sleeping at the moment. <laughs> they're just they all shut the power down. <laughs> yeah. So the marauder is going to go next. He's going to overheat. <sighs> um, just remember, he's got that penalty. Uh, yep. He's in a, I guess it doesn't matter. Was but, he? Yeah. He was in a penalty. We have one heat from before, so right. from last turn. So, so plus so. one TN. Correct. Plus one your to your the old target number. Okay. So three, four, five, six, seven. So I need sevens. Okay. Wow, nothing. I whiffed the whole thing. Okay. Did you really? Oh, wait. Uh, I needed sixes, but I still whiffed. Because I, I stood still. Oh, right. Wow. How bad did you roll? I rolled like I missed it. Fours. I don't even know because I picked up the dice too quick, but yeah. I'm pretty sure I missed with everything. Maybe I had one, but it doesn't matter. Um, <laughs> Could the, matter. The Shadowhawk's going to fire at the Caesar. Okay. Um, Caesar is a juicy target right now, stripped. Yeah. Ready, finger on the ejection button. <laughs> yeah, so the Shadow Hawk is gonna fire. You also have point of heat there. Are you overheating yep. again? No, I don't think so. Um, he's gonna do three. So he's gonna do three at medium. So he's um, two, three, four, fives. And you got the heat in there too? Six, six of the heat? Yeah. Sixes, yeah. Basically nets out the, the heat from standing still. Correct, yeah, that makes sense. The sixes. Oh boy! So I hit with three, and I get a. And a so crit. well, I mean, if you want to roll the crit, you can, but that Caesar is destroyed. Oh, it's destroyed. Oh, I only had three left. I rolled an eight weapon, and then a seven. So we got a weapon and a motive. You're an awful human. Yeah. But it's dead, right? Maybe it had regenerates. <laughs> it's a troll. <laughs> yeah. Well, that, now actually now yeah, this marauder's dead. Right? So yeah, he falls down this turn. Um, so that's those two. So I got these guys left. Mm. Um, I missed the rifleman, right? You have not hit the rifleman. Yeah. You whiffed everything on the rifleman. So the, yeah, I'm going to fire at the rifleman then. And I think we're probably at long. Uh, oh, no, we're, we're just at 12. We're at 12. Okay. So we're at medium. So I'll do four and four. So the same. Shoot. And they'll both have the same target number. So you're basically two, three, three fives, right? Yeah, two, oh, God. three, four, oh, fives. Okay. So I'll hit with all four of the first. So four. It's not going so well. And another through armor. And four and more four pips. More. Is that two crits? It's going to be two pips. It's in force withdrawal. And you get, two, yeah, sorry, two crits. Well, Nine is this. nothing. Nothing. Six. A weapon hit. Okay. Well, we're gonna turn up this. We have two turns now. This is starting to hurt, huh? I. I'm down again. The, the Atlas is. Atlas is uh, hurt. Not in force withdrawal yet, though. Not in force withdrawal, but dude, that awesome is. Stress. Devastating. Oh, I over, oh no, I can't over. I could have overheated the Atlas. Though. Yeah. That would have been dumb. All right. You, well, how you feeling? Uh, do not look like I'm, I'm going to keep good. going. At least one more turn. I mean, this is do or die stuff. Yeah. I can't let you get away with Dr. Hans Jorgensen or whatever the heck his name Dr. is. Dr. Robotnik. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, who knows what that what that guy with that scientist on board? And he's got a board. What drive. secrets he will give the Calder Protector? Maybe maybe he's like a Johnny Mnemonic. No, I was gonna say like a spy. Like an encounter protector actually just like uh, extracted him yeah. from from a deep cover operation. Mm. Stories write themselves, Tom. They do. All right. Just uh, a chat GPT. So on that note, guys, stick around. Turn six is on the way. Oh, 
Let's see. I'm gonna watch you lose initiative. Shocking. <laughs> Turn six. Here we go. so bad. Uh, turn six. My meager, my forces are being mowed down. But uh, I'm going to see what I can do because listen, I can get a throw armor critical on that dropship. Things can happen. There is still hope. I know uh, the Atlas is almost toasted to be honest. The Rifleman is in force withdrawal but is going to do uh, the following here. So I think... <clears throat> And the Rifleman, unfortunately, has a weapon hit, if you recall. I do, yeah. yeah. So does the Atlas, actually. Yeah. So, um, I'm only doing two at extreme. But I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have to go for it. All right. I Why need... not the Shadowhawk? Aren't we at... Okay, whatever. You do, yeah. I got I to gotta go after... There's Why don't not... you shoot at the dropship? That's what I'm saying. I'm oh. not shooting at the dropship. Oh, I'm smart, shooting. smart. Oh, I'm, I'm not sorry. shooting yeah, Shadowhawk. I would have said to shoot at the dropship. Yeah. Okay. All right. So two pips against the dropship. Okay. For 14 damage. We're over that. We're over the halfway mark. Yeah. Oh my God. What range is the Atlas in to the dropship? Is it, it is it at long oh. yet? I would think so. Uh, no, you're still at 20. Let me find the best place to measure from. Yeah, you're still at 22. So slow. I'm gonna shoot the Atlas. I'm gonna try to take it down. I think that's a good possibility. Okay. So what do you do? Four? Do you know what? I'm gonna start with the demolisher into the atlas. Okay. Yeah, we're at nine inches and six inches. Yeah. So, so three, four, five. Yeah. Six with your stealth armor. Come on, Demolisher. Demolisher did great last time. He's got a beat on that atlas. So we're gonna see if I can continue. Got it. So that's four pips. Another I love it. So it's in, it's at least in force yeah. withdrawal, not dead yet. Two pips. Can but I, you do get, can a I get a critical here? Come on. Oh, that's, so that's, nice. a that's not helping me. It's not helping me because it's just standing there anyway. Yeah, I was going to say, I'm not trying to do um, that. All right, well, my, all right, my atlas is just going to fire. Um, I, you know, yeah, I'm just going to fire everything at the atlas. Atlas on atlas crime. Here we go. Yeah, he's dead. I lost the dice somewhere, uh, but that's dead. All right, so uh, he's dead. Yeah, he's the goner. All right, so the Atlas is down. That's a win. Uh, and I put a couple pips on the dropship, but we'll see. Tom, you're up. Yeah. So I'm going to start with the dropship into the rifleman. Okay. So, so two pips into the rifleman. Yeah. That doesn't count. So uh, one, nine. Yeah, nine will hit, actually. Okay, so, so you get one more pip of damage against oh, the right He's not in water, right? He is not. Okay, so yeah. Uh, so you get one more pip. That is a critical hit, Tom. Uh, 11. Oh, my Engine. God. Nice. Kill me. Please just kill me. <laughs> um, <clears throat> how many pips does he have left? Like three? He's got two. Two, okay. Um, the Shadow Hawk is going to fire at him, then. With uh, right. with three. Now Not remember, three. he's got that. He's got yep. that. Uh, yeah. It's one one heat pip, um, and he moved. Correct. <clears throat> so he's a three, four, five, six, seven. And then sevens. Oh, Going to three. So All right. Dead. So the rifleman's okay. destroyed. Rifleman destroyed. The valiant. I mean, the Avalon Hustlers are valiant. There's no doubt about it. Uh, but they just cannot withstand the barrage that is. Uh... Dude, an Atlas and an Awesome together. The Awesome Atlas, killer. If they were like Voltron, this would be over already. Like they're nuts. Jeez, they're man. so strong. They're yeah. Well, they're good variants too. Yeah. I mean, the 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 nine Q. I think it is right. That's yeah. just solid. Well, um, the Atlas is going to. Fire into the demolisher tank. All right. Um, Good luck. Things made of steel. 
Yeah. I don't know what that means. So he's gonna overheat. <clears throat> um, oh yeah, you might as well, because he's dead. Because he's dead. Um, so he stood still. Mm -hmm. So he's at a two, four, five, six. I'll hit. Oh, and I get it. Why? I was just thinking in my head. I swear to you, I was just like, any, I can take that. Just anything but a throw armor crit. Now watch. You're going to freaking roll 12s and head cap him. So. No. Six. Still, it's a weapon hit. Wow. Which is devastating in this particular and do I get a scenario. Motor right uh, no. Oh, oh, wait a minute. You're hitting the. The demolisher tank. Well, wait a minute, actually. So six. You rolled. It's a, you rolled a six on your crit. That's nothing on vehicles. Yeah. It's a right. different table. Ha ha. Okay. And then here's the the motive is a five. So nothing. nothing. Yeah. All right. So, you're, so you're good. All right. Okay. 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 But still, I can't believe you're able to throw them critically, you jerk. And then, um, yeah, so they're in short two. So then, or medium. Uh, the awesome is going to fire the demolisher as well. Uh, four damage. So he still still as well, too. Four, five, right? <laughs> wow, but I only get two. If oh wait, it's not sixes, right? He's a three, so he's down to a two because of that. Four, five, yeah. So two hips and a motive. Oh, that was close. Yeah, right? no, no, no. Uh, there's nine. Oh, weapon. No, no, no. Just motive uh, is. Oh, oh yeah. That's so, a minus one inch. Yeah. Oh, oh no. Whatever will you do? Keep moving. I'll move okay. even slower. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> it's the end of the turn. Yeah. I don't think you can. I'm doing one more turn. Okay. I'm. I. I am going to go for the drop ship with everything. And you're gonna get. You're gonna get. I'm your gonna initiative. get that. I'm gonna get that freaking critical. Oh, I thought you were gonna get the initiative this turn, dude. I can't win initiative. I've won. It's been this let, many let's, turns. Let's, let's just review. Many it's many turns. been zero turns of initiative one for me, including the first turn. Right, because you were the attacker. No, I, I, yeah. yeah, I I win. Well, I mean, I guess I did technically win, but I didn't win that one. All right, so you're on turn three, right? Yeah, uh, well, I the, mean, on the drop. Remember, ship. the Atlas is dead. Atlas don't, is dead. Don't let that fool you. He's dead. <laughs> I don't got, let that fool I you. Got two mechs left. The Kestrel's coming back. He's gonna. He's just gonna kamikaze. You. He's like, Tush -tush -tush. yeah, I should have done that. that you can't. Okay, Last it's against ditch. It's the video game rules. Well, it just it just clips right through. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> clips right through. Um, all right. Well, let's. I want to play out turn seven, and I think that'll be that. I mean, it's either I'm gonna. You're, I mean, you're at fourteen. You're you were you got pretty close. I'm getting close. You know what hurt me? I'm, not, mean, I'm not giving up yet. But the that archer, Atlas that, and the, the, uh, the, the Marauder, archer, the archer twelve <laughs> killed me because. That's an extra three to four damage every turn. And it's another target. And it's another target. This would have put firepower in. It was, it was a clutch roll. All right, I want to try. I'm going to see what happens. Do you want to just roll it right now? Yeah, because I'm pretty sure. You know what? Let's go to the recap for turn seven. I mean, it's going to be the Atlas standing alone. For turn six, and then we're going to turn seven. And then him and the awesome roll. Just, punch, just each punch each other in the face. All right, let's do it. Guys, stay tuned. Uh, face punching about to happen. This is it, uh, do or die. So I, I've convinced myself that I could spend a turn, one more turn, trying to kill this this awesome. I could put eight pips into it, which wouldn't even, I don't think we'd get through, it wouldn't even get through his out. Mm -hmm. So I am instead gonna shoot the dropship and hope that maybe I get a throw armor critical and maybe something special happens. You're in long range. I'm in long range. In we're gonna start with the extreme range with Demolisher Tank. Your Atlas blocks line of sight from the Demolisher. It's so tall. You can see it's right over it. Okay. No, we play real. You cannot see through it. I hit twice. Yeah. Two pips. Here it comes, the Atlas. Can I find Tom? 16 pips. 
It's a through armor critical of a lifetime. Of a dream. Of your dreams. No. Ooh. But it's four pips. So what's the drop ship down to now? Six armor. Six. You were close. Six armor. Six armor. I didn't hit it last turn, did I? No. I don't think you did. If only. Now what's going to happen? I don't know. I guess you shoot and see. Yeah. So, spray and pray. Spray and pray. So the Shadow Hawk at long range is going to overheat again. Oh. And he's going to do four pips at medium. So he's plus one. So he's a four, five, six, seven. So. And you took the plus one from his last heat penalty? Yeah. Okay. That's, that's the, yeah, the plus gotcha, one. So he's gotcha, a gotcha. four. Gotcha. Four, five, six, seven. Now I have ballistic reinforced armor. Uh, what do you got in your stat It's line? all E and E. Is it for the no. Shadow Hawk? <laughs> oh, well, I don't know. Listen, Tom, I believe you. Okay. If only. Oh, I don't even know if oh, what did I hit with. Got a couple, of, a couple yeah. of pips. Two. Two pips. Yeah. So you deal two pips of damage. That does go internal on the Demolisher. Um, and you roll an eight, which Seven. is nothing. It's eight, you're right. And then my, do I get a motive? Motive. Ten. Ten. Wow, he's in stuck in place. Stuck in place. Uh, so another minus. Uh, fantastic. One. Okay. Last but not least, the awesome. I guess I can't shoot him because your Alice is in the way. So, oh, uh, Alice, it is. And ironically, you have E N E, so I, my ballistic reinforced armor does literally nothing. Yeah. So are we at short range? Yet? I'm pretty no, sure. No, I don't think we are. No, we're not. We're four inches. Yeah. Okay. So, um, two, four, five, fives. Four so pips. four pips. All right. Well, nothing happens. Yeah. Not even a stretch. But I'm going to say this. I'm going another turn. Let's do it. Oh, I did. Turn eight. eight. Three or four. Uh, so by turn eight. And what turn is this? It's turn. This was turn seven. So if you, this thing survives. Oh, so I should be at four then. Yeah. And then at the end of turn I don't eight. think. If my demolisher can get into long range, I potentially win here. Okay, let's do it. All right, turn eight, it's coming up. Camera turned off. Aaron rolled his initiative and beat me by it's, one. It's really true. Like I still have. He to, saved. I he's gonna get them. Out. He's, you're gonna get them in like loose sight. You know, in like a little desk thing. That's right. Just like right, like encase them, which was actually important. Yeah. Um, to make sure I had line of sight and all that stuff. I mean, it is a big dropship, but yeah. I could. I guess I could have crowded you right and like blocked you. Right. Like you could have came into him. base to base and stupid stuff like that. Right? Yeah. With my dropship, he's just dropship Sorry, hops from base to base. Can't yeah. shoot me. There really was probably Actually, no Actually, if I way. Like, landed here, you really could. That'd be really fun. The, we measured it four times. Uh, Tom insists that the Demolisher is, in fact, in long range. Um, yeah, we double-checked the motive the hits. Miser. It got two motive hits for one inch, of, like, you know, basically minus yeah. one a piece. So he still has an inch of movement. So it could happen. Yeah. If I do seven pips of damage, <laughs> I, I do have to hit with everything, though. If I miss but one, Tom, your dropship will take off at the end of this turn. How's that for drama? Mm. You need to at least do one structure to be not. Worth That's what I mean. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Right. I can't just strip your armor. I have to hit with everything, which is seven pips. And Tom doesn't like it. You said it. Listen, you gave me the idea. So here's what we're going to do, Tom. Okay, let's go. <laughs> yeah, you got your luck back. Oh, I lost, so I have to shoot first. You do have to shoot first. Okay. First up, Shadowhawk, into your Demolisher. Um, we're still at medium. Yeah, I don't even need to measure. We're at medium. Mm -hmm. He's going to do three pips. Uh, he's going to uh, overheat one again. He's just going all in to 
kill this thing. Okay. So I'll do four. He's at a plus two target number. Okay. So I'm a three, minus one, two. So I'm four. Yep, that I'm sounds six, right. Seven. So not too bad. Yeah. He's yeah. just like trudging along, and you just blew a hole right through With the side of him. Three. <laughs> I get three. Yes. Is he dead? Yeah, he's dead. And by the way, before anybody says anything, we did. We have these two Fords where vehicles, it's like death zero. Yeah. So the, the tracked vehicles can go across them, just in case anybody was wondering. Yeah, and we used them actually um, in the last bat rep, too. We did, we did. So uh, the Demolisher is, in fact, destroyed. Okay. Time. Job well done, Shadowhawk, sir. Um, unfortunately, the Awesome is now up. For you, that is. Uh, he is in your rear arc, so we'll actually do an extra one pit of damage. He cannot overheat, so don't worry about that. Um, so uh, he's uh, three, four, five, five. I just don't. No more twelves. Okay, I can take I hit that. with everything. Well, I had three sixes, man. If I would have hit with them, so five more pips of damage. Got it. Close. It's close, but the atlas is holding shoot together. With oh, you didn't. That's right. And, and you're with what well, long range, right? So we'll that's three. We are in long range, okay. so I'm up to three. Can he overheat? Yes, he can overheat 10. Oh. <laughs> he, can overheat. he can literally endlessly overheat, just keeps just infinite. Feet. Yeah. So yeah, at long range, he does three, okay. And the same thing, so he's a three minus one, so a two, three, four, um, five, long range, right? Yeah. Five, six, sevens with the snow, so. Uh, right. And I hit with all three. All right, that is going to be internal, Tom. You ready for this through armor? You, you ready for this headshot? I'm not ready for it because you've been. What do you want? You want a headshot? Oh God, my God, so dude! Close. If you called that, oh, what is that? I think that's weapon, right? A ten. A ten. A ten. Oh no, it's fire, fire control. control. Nice. Okay, but man, oh, that was close. I felt it. I felt it could have happened. Oh, that's not. That's actually worse. Okay, so. Destruction <laughs> reigns supreme. You're firing. This is your this is you the moment. One mech left. Now, I do think though at long range, it's less than a five, right? I think it's a four. Uh, I don't know. So it was minus four. Mm -hmm. So you're a three. Yeah. Four, five, six, seven for that. Minus four is third. But the weather though. So it, it's three plus, plus four. Yeah, I think it's a four. Oh no, it's a three because extreme was plus two because of the weather and long and, is plus one. Right, so, so it was a cumulative two more. Yeah. So we need threes. If you, first off, if you kill it, I'm gonna rip this table. Just apart. smash the drop shit. <laughs> <laughs> but also if you miss it, I'm gonna smash the I table. I mean, it could happen. Yeah. There's oh no my way. God. You're gonna hit it with everything. Yeah. Look at all those, and the through armor critical, through armor it armor. happened. So three, three pips, right? Three pips. Yeah, I'm out of space here. One, two, three, okay. All right. And the critical. Yeah, which so. I don't even know if I have. Yeah, I have criticals, but I don't know what the table is for. Is for it drop like space? Yeah, it's, it's, it's definitely in here. Are you actually allowed to kill a drop? Dropship, here we go. 2d6 roll. It does have its own yeah, table. Yeah, it's got its okay. own table. Which is not on our quick is, it, is there any way to kill it or no? I assume it does. There. This isn't Star Wars, guys. There is no way to instantly kill it, but I can hit a thruster, which may buy me another turn. There you go. Let's okay. see what happens. Ten. Wow, I thought that No was critical true. hit. Thank you. No. But Dice gods, all you're the You're not sacrifices. out of the woods yet. You're There's not out of the woods yet. Goats in your Here backyard. we go. It's great. For the 21st Avalon Hoppers. <laughs> the glory of... As I'm like punching I'll with the kid. Like... Dude, this guy's like got a fire control hit his yeah. cockpit, <laughs> like all fuzzy. Just walking into oblivion. Yeah. Oh wow. <laughs> yeah. That's internal. Um, um, one of the structure that she does. There's no longer space for there. I rolled a three on the crit table, Tom, which is your docking collar has been hit. Oh. Yeah. Well. Now you can't dock with your jump ship either. So the question is, you know, can I repair it in time? I still can kill your Atlas, right? No, you can kill my Atlas. Do we go another turn? Like, does can the Atlas? Do you have to like now kill it? 
No, I mean, that I think that's how this should work. All right, I'm saying you want to so, go, you want to so go this, one more. So this is, you know, if you would have downed that Kestrel, I would have had to rescue it. If you if you stop me from um, the party, I think you have an opportunity to destroy it, which is the only like. Okay. Otherwise, if I kill your Atlas, right, I'll have time to repair it and get out of here. Okay. Uh, turn nine is coming up. This is getting intense. I only rolled five hundred. Ooh, am I gonna win initiative? No, of course not. Never well, on camera time. Okay, right. here we go. Turn nine. It's happening. Stay tuned. We are back with this this unending finale. Uh, Tom's convinced me. It's like it's like GM GM led here. Uh, so basically, the dropship uh, is stuttering in in midair. Uh, engines been hit. The docking collar's been hit. Smoke billowing from the sides, uh, refusing to surrender. This Atlas still hanging on. If Long you range. Can, if you can destroy the Atlas this turn, Tom, then. Your dropship will be able to make emergency land, make emergency repairs, and get away before yeah. any of my reinforcements arrive. Or, if you do more than, if you put me in force to draw, he's going to crap. He's going to try to land, and the thing's going to buckle under him. It's going to roll. <laughs> it's just <laughs> like, a, like Indiana Jones. My Atlas is going to be running away. <laughs> <Yeah. from it. laughs> I love it. It's going to be a nightmare. And okay. then poor Kestrel will finally be taken out as it rolls on top of it. Okay. Uh, so, so you shoot first, Tom. I shoot first. You do. Are we in medium range? Long range. Are you sure? I'll measure again, but I'm pretty it's sure. So it's so big, it's hard to tell. Uh, 13 inches from like. Okay. The best, the best, it's most advantageous. So I gotta land off. I mean, I only need three, Tom. Still only need threes? Come on, please whiff something. It'd be hilarious. Oh, so close. But no. So you did four. I get a critical hit. You do. Get a critical hit, Tom. You ready for this? I should have just left the page open. Uh, aerospace, critical hit table, here we go. 2d6, it's happening. Seven, which is a thruster. Wow. Oh, you're in trouble now. Oh. You're not. You're actually not. Uh, you're actually not shut down. But yeah, I mean that's pretty great. So, can you destroy this atlas? So, oh boy. Four more pips. Four more pips and a critical hit. A nine. Close, close, close. What the heck? Nothing. That's a nothing. nothing. Okay. <sighs> Dude, this atlas um, pilot is such a such a boss. Three from the dropship. Oh, well, I'm rolling six of them, not getting those crits. So uh, well, it's dead. Three minutes. Okay, it's dead. The Atlas is destroyed. However, uh, my your dropship drop ship is, is destroyed. Can we pull one of those legs off? We absolutely can. <laughs> that dude. So this is like a draw? They're magnetized. So, yeah. Take it off. Let's see what happens, Tom. Oh my goodness, it's, it's glorious. Look, this is It's glorious. The dropship. Like you can just imagine, yeah, boom, like boom, boom. shockwave of yeah. dirt. Everybody the in the base is the goes like this. Yeah, right. <laughs> Into the fuel tanks, boom. massive explosion. <laughs> Your Atlas gets exploded. Oh my god! A tree goes through the Shadowhawk's cockpit. I mean, poor Shadowhawk. <laughs> He's like, but I find fresh armor. <laughs> and also, I just bled off my heat because I didn't fire. Oh my god! I'm good, I'm good bro. Okay. Well, yeah, that, was, that was uh, that was a good finale. I can't believe you took it. I really thought I was gonna I thought I had you. You never I had thought me. you I thought you had me. Never had I me. thought you never had me. You never had your drop ship. <laughs> I thought I thought you had me. I don't know how I pulled that out of my hat. It was because winning is winning. The Atlas Yeah. It was because the Atlas was able to just, just like 
plow through, <laughs> yeah. wade through fire, and just <laughs> just keep just keep, keep unloading. There's literally a guy hanging on his leg as he's like right. what, like a kid crying. In right, a and department he's just store. still shooting. <laughs> yeah. and Demolisher did a pretty good job. Yeah, I should have I should have fired. You know, the thing I always forget is like the vehicles. You should just try to hit them to like mess up their movement with yeah. crit early in the game with the motive. Yeah. It was good. I, th I think it was actually ended it was up very being pretty fun. well balanced. Yeah. yeah, it ended up being pretty well balanced. It was a fun ending to the campaign. Uh, very cinematic. You can imagine the dropship crashing out of the sky. Yeah. I and mean, then, my, then my awesome turns around. He's like, ha, ah, I got you. And he's like, boom. <laughs> and just his uh, heart sinks a little bit. Oh, man. Maybe that champion in the repair base survived, though. You know, tactically on this one, what tactic? I do, I'm, but it's the little decisions well, that firing matter. Firing tactics. Right, like, do I shoot the dropship, or do I try to, like, wear you down? And, you know, even for you, like, what do I shoot? Like, you mentioned the tank and things like that, like, these little yeah, that's things. That's probably the only mistake I made. The rest of it was, again, uh, uh, discipline and focus fire. I, I had hurt the ar archer. You stayed keep on hitting. it. It was smart. I hurt the Caesar. I know. Keep hitting. I know, you did a really good job not switching off targets and I you know the, the units were not fast enough maybe to, to do that anything with somebody can complain like maybe if I would have tapped the atlas he wouldn't have lasted this long yeah but then again I might not have killed something you'd be firing twice and it wouldn't matter so it's who knows two and one six and eight something like that four four in the hat and three in the bag <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, all right well this uh, I feel like this whole campaign was a bit of a draw uh, I yeah, mean, me too. You won two out of the right. I guess I didn't win this one. Four, right? I mean, I, is this a draw or did this is you a win draw? This? I mean, I lost literally every single unit. Did, did was that your? Does it matter? It does matter. You know. Also, I killed the dude on board, um, as your dropship is now destroyed. He's not destroyed. He's not destroyed. They got destroyed. He's I mean, just I feel like real flesh wound. is all right. Let's roll a d6. All right. On a four or better, the, the scientist is killed. Oh, he's alive. Yeah. I win, minor victory. Okay. Minor victory. Or do you, Tom, whisk him away into the sunset, you know, into some, into some insurgent cell on the planet somewhere? Who knows? Why don't we wrap this one up? A couple of things. Uh, number one. Like and subscribe. Like and subscribe and leave a comment. Uh, let us know what you thought about the campaign. Let us know what you think about Alpha Strike. Let us know what system you love the most, uh, what you want to see more of. Uh, I, I know some of you, I know what some of you will say. You know who I'm talking to. Uh, <laughs> I love you. Um, but definitely let us know that. Also, um, let us know what you thought about sort of the narrative uh, and less structured vibe to these battle reports, right? Um, we've been a little less rigid in terms of the, you know, the win and loss conditions and the balance and just sort of been having fun with it. Uh, we've been enjoying it, but interested to uh, to know building what our viewers story. think. Yeah, building the story. I want to find somebody to like write a comic of this. Oh, if you can write comics, or or that you know, like an animated little. That would be this cool. This is a good. I mean, it's like it ended up being a good story as we like evolved it. Yeah, you know, it was like, neat. Yeah, it was definitely fun. Um, so yeah, leave a comment, leave a like, subscribe, and if you want to help out the channel, there's really two ways to do it. Number one. Uh, you can buy some merch. We got some good stuff. We got new embroidered hats, you know, the, the little little beanie caps, whatever they're called. Yeah. Um, you know, we've got t-shirts and all sorts of great stuff. You can check all that. Coffee cups. Great stuff. Um, and the second way is by uh, signing up on Patreon. Uh, so that's really the only way, you know, we keep the, uh, the lights on, as it were, you know, updated cameras, updated audio, new terrain, all that stuff. Um, so if you want to help out the channel, it's as little as $1. Just one, Tom. One dollar per month. That'll make you holla. Uh, speaking of money, Aries Games and Minis, probably the, my favorite place to spend it. Uh, you get all the good stuff. In fact, I bought that dropship through Aries Games and Minis. Derek shipped it right to Brian. Brian painted it for me. Uh, Derek's awesome to work with. Uh, you can get uh, frontline gaming mats. You can get mechs. You can get dice, the books, pretty much everything you need to get into the hobby if you're new or if you want to expand your collection. Uh, also, Fighting Piranha decals here that I had on my Avalon Hussars also uh, available at Aries Games and Minis. But that said, Tom, any closing thoughts on this wonderful battle report? No, it was really fun. Yeah, man, it was a good time. It was a good time. All right, well, guys, as always, thank you so much for watching. And of course, stay tuned. Always great stuff coming from Death From Above Wargaming.